what you doing? Oh, nothing. Sock and I are just brewing up some punishment. Oh, no. You want to smell? It smells of raspberries. Nah. Mmm. Well, it looks like I'm not the only one that will be dealing with some punishment. This? Ugh. How do you eat this? One bite at a time. All right, now that that's out of the way, let's go ahead and make me some raspberry flavored tea with the help of our little podcat, Sokka. That's enough. I Coward. I don't want to use all of it. You might want some of it later. Oh, no burning yourself, kitten. All right, now we'll just let that steep for a little bit here. Is this exciting, kitten? It looks like you're enthralled. It's the most exciting thing ever. Well, while that steeps, we're going to go prepare to consume this stuff. Join us upstairs when our faces are going to contort into that of disgust. Hi everyone. Thank you for being a patron. So, as you may remember, in episode six, was it? Yep. Will lost his first challenge and went over his 30 seconds because he's silly and has chosen to shorten his time frame <sighs> on his recap. And will be subjected to a punishment of eating a wonderful fruit, namely cherries. Now, it's winter time, so, well, technically not yet winter time because the solstice has not happened. But the abil uh, availability of cherries, I, again, okay, so here's a little bit of a, a, a secret. We don't speak perfectly. I edit. Anyway, so Will's punishment food, which he got to pick himself, so I think it's a little bit of a cheat, is dark chocolate with cherries in it. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm not going to lie. I'm not looking forward to this. I, I, if I don't make it out of this alive, you can have all my stuff. I already kind of have all your stuff. But now you don't have, then you wouldn't have to ask to use it. So I can have your guitar. You could have my guitar, yes. Okay. You heard it here first. Yeah, if, so. If Will dies because of cherry consumption, which he's not allergic to, by the way, I get his guitar. But the good news is I'm not the only one who failed. Because in episode seven, Phoenix failed in her more generous 45 second allotment. It was a longer chapter. And yet she failed. That's not the point. So <laughs> she's got her own punishment because she gets to eat the delicious raspberries. But again, raspberries are a tricky fruit, not always in season in the winter here. So she's gonna have to do a, a, something different. So she's got a uh, raspberry tea, which, I mean, that sounds delightful on a nice, cold, almost winter day. Ow. A nice gray Pacific Northwest. <laughs> so, are you, are you prepared for this? What happens if, you, if, if it hurts you? Or if you die, what, what happens? Do I get your stuff? You can have my copy of The Princess and Mr. Wiffle. Well, that's delightful. <laughs> All right, uh, so who goes first? 
Well, you lost first. Okay, here we go. Here goes nothing. Enthralling video right here. This is the content that, uh, that the kids crave these days, so... Seems like you don't want to do this. I don't. Alright, so here it is. This is a Cherry Tango chocolate bar from Giardelli's. Your delis, please sponsor us. I promise the comments about the nastiness had nothing to do with your chocolate and everything to do with your cherries. Not sponsored. Here we go. How is it? Oh, just hit the cherry. You had that look on your face with the chocolate. No, it is. Was... How is it? Bad. It's mm. bad? Can I have some? Yeah. I'm gonna prove that it's not. Oh. So that piece doesn't even have any cherry in it. That's perfectly delightful. Mmm. I just got the cherry flavor. Yeah. That's wonderful. Oh. Mm. Oh, oh. Ham it up. Oh. oh, well, never again. Never again? Never again. They're all yours. Yay! <laughs> now, it's your turn. I know you've been dreading this. I don't like raspberries. Weirdo. I'm a weirdo. Yes. Or at least a weirdo. Fair point. You sure there's no cat hair in this? I mean, we saw Sokka helping you make this. I made sure. Okay. Have to. Take a real sip. I can take a real sip. Take a, take a real sip. I took a real sip. Okay. Just to prove that I'm not as much of a baby as you are. Mm -hmm. Okay, I believe you. Ugh. Mind if I try? Take it. Please take it. Don't spill it, but take it. Nothing against the tea, really. Oh well, yeah, it's quite nice. Nope. Who got punished here? I think I did. Nope. <laughs> well, either way you slice it, here's to one more day above the roses. One more day above the roses. <laughs>